Hey there all craft beer lovers, very much welcome to yet another beer review. For this time around guys, we are heading back towards Vaxholm in the Stockholm region in Sweden and back to Hop Notch Brewing. Taking a look tonight at their Rewaka New Zealand IPA. Clocking in at 6% ABV, 440ml can. There you go. Simple wraparound label. Plain Jane can. There's the other, there's a look at that crazy artwork. There we go. Hop notch. So that's basically all she wrote. A uh, little bit of text there. Not gonna read it out here. You can uh, pause the video if you like. Just the usual banter. So with that said, let's get that can cracked open and see what we are going to get then. There we go. Good little smoke. Okay, so Hopnotch doing some really, really good beers. Uh, there we go. I think they're also doing a lot of you know, kind of New Zealand inspired IPAs and such. Uh, and they got a female head brewer, which is kind of cool, of course, in a very, very male dominated business, which of course craft beer is. So always interesting with, uh, you know, the ladies joining in all right as you can see there a lot of head on this one three fingers worth creamy white a good deal of carbonation honey golden color very carbonated right onto the nose see what we get yes yeah, so it's a nice uh, kind of quite mild uh, hoppy aroma Faint tropical nose, very faint. Okay, doesn't really smell super much. So with that said, let's dive in and see what we get. Cheers all. Okay. Okay, so this is a little bit of a, a little bit of an uh, unusual taste. Uh, again, again, guys, bear with me here. Bear with me. It's got a very, very dry mouthfeel to it, almost like Pilsner dry. Then you got kind of an aromatic, hop spicy aroma and taste. A little bit of malts shining through. It's not really tropical. It's more green. It's more towards the greener side of things. Green, spicy, <clears throat> sorry, aromatic. But it's still quite drinkable. You don't notice any 6% ABV in there. Uh, let's go for the final zip, guys. It's not bad. Hmm. For me, it's not a bad beer, but it's not one of the best either. I would say it's a nice in-between beer, nice middle-of-the-road beer. Uh, I would have wanted a little bit more perhaps on the, the tropical note uh, side of things here when it comes to taste. It's quite dry, almost Pilsner-like dry. It's spicy, a little bit aromatic, slightly green. Uh, a little bit unusual, but if that's your thing, if you like unusual beers then give it a go. A little bit too much carbonated for me, but anyways, uh, Rewaka New Zealand IPA, 6%, not bad guys, uh, but for me it doesn't really do it, but it's okay. Uh, 3.5 out of 5. Thank you for watching.